I'm Tom, the Sports Explorer. If you are new to this channel, I'm exploring our world through sport and adventure. If you love travel, sport and adventure, please do consider subscribing. Now this week, I'm doing something a little bit different on the channel because the United Arab Emirates is celebrating its 49th National Day this week. And to celebrate that fact, I thought I'd showcase to you the favourite adventures of mine that I've done in the country in 2020. I'm now the highest person in a public point in the UAE. And all of them are pretty good for social distancing as well. The UAE is rich with adventures and sporting stories. From its vibrant city locations behind me, that is the skyline of downtown Dubai, to its desert landscapes. And I'll link in the description below to the videos in full so you can pick your favourite adventure and explore more. If it's kayaking you like, then one of the most relaxing and peaceful adventures in the UAE is exploring the Abu Dhabi Eastern Mangroves by kayak. This coastal forest has peacefully watched over the growth of Abu Dhabi whilst always retaining its tranquil and natural beauty. The UAE sits within the world's fifth largest desert, the Arabian Desert, and because of that, your eyes become quite accustomed to sand and a yellowy tint around. And of course, away from the coast, it's hard to find water. So when you come across something that combines both greenery and water, well, it's magnificent. It's genuinely like a pick-me-up for your senses. It's the tiramisu of the UAE. You'll feel a million miles away from city life and the desert landscape by kayaking through the acres of natural waterways. But be warned about one of the water channels. We're in a waterway which has the nickname Divorce Channel. And that's because it's so tight, couples end up arguing, jostling for position and capsizing as they try to avoid the mangroves. So if your marriage is on the rocks, don't come up this channel. There's a good tip for you. A tip you don't often find in travel blogs. Another kayaking location which is incredible in the country is Al Khor Kayak, just outside the east coast city of Khor for Khan. It's perhaps not the most famous UAE kayaking destination, but don't let that stop you. It's a perfect location here, nestled into the mountains. And what's brilliant about it is there's loads of facilities, there's some playgrounds for the kids, there's a cafe overlooking the lake, there's some nice viewing deck areas as well, there's a shop and restrooms, and of course, there's loads of parking. Kayaking here will cost you 30 dirhams for half an hour, which is a really good price. And the nice thing is you get a really nice size double kayak, which gives you plenty of room and also a nice comfortable, smooth ride as well. <laughs> good place to kayak, isn't it? Yeah. Do let me know in the comments below what your favorite adventures are in the UAE. And you can follow at the Sports Explorer on Instagram as well. Now, there is no doubting that hiking is the most loved adventure activity to do in the country. And there is good reason for that, with endless amounts of mountain trails to embark on across the Hajar Mountains. I'm still trying to get up this first mountain. So, how about hiking to the UAE's highest public point at Jebel Jace? Right, shall we get to the top of this mountain? I think so. <sighs> One final push. <sighs> Come on. Just a few more steps. Ten steps to go. 
and we've made it. The south summit of Jebel Jais, the highest public point in the UAE, 1,640 meters. It is an incredible day out with a really interesting story to know about at the summit as well. Click the link in the description below to learn more. Another amazing hike to do in the UAE is the Al Rabi Tower hike. This hike, I believe, provides you with the best summit in the country overlooking the city of Khan and the Gulf of Oman. Let me know in the comments what you think of that view. Corfican Port, which you can see just down there, is actually the region's only natural deep sea port. It is one of the UAE's most important container ports. You know, I've heard on the summit since I've been here, people referring to this place a bit like looking down on Rio. For me, not that I've been there, but it has that same sort of aura or landscape as Table Mountain looking down on Cape Town, the coast and the urban hub at the bottom and the summit rising above it all. Is this the UAE's little table mountain? I've just spotted that's the moon behind me and the world's tallest tower. Well, I know the world's tallest tower is there, but I didn't see the moon, you get me. If it's less of a hike and more of a walk you are after, and you enjoy the sound of flowing fresh water, yes, even in a desert landscape, then you need to head to Wadi Shish. Oh, look at all this fresh water. I can't resist. If only every hike in the UAE you were greeted with a lovely pool of fresh water. Oh, it's glorious. And finally, cycling. The UAE loves cycling, but if it is adrenaline you're looking for on two wheels, head up to Hatta Wadi Hub and rent out a mountain bike to explore over 52 kilometers of mountain trails. The route I'm doing today is the Green 3 route. It's actually one of the easiest routes to do, and that's because it is summer and it's extremely hot, and I didn't want to be in the mountain stuck all day. So I've taken it easy today. It takes about an hour to do this route. The tracks are great. It's loads of fun, up and down, different terrains, some bridges to cross, water to go through. Sometimes you just need to stop and take it all in, don't you? It's not because I'm tired. To be fair, after all of that, I am pretty tired. Oh, I'm shattered already. So there we go, my favorite adventures in the United Arab Emirates in 2020, and not a bad way as well to learn about the country as it celebrates its 49th National Day. I hope you can find some inspiration in the adventures I've showcased in this video. Don't forget, I'll put the links to the full videos in the description below. Thanks for watching this video and being a part of the Sports Explorer journey so far. Don't forget to find out more. You can visit thesportsexplorer.com. Happy National Day, UAE. Let's keep exploring.